It's me, Stephanie, and I have a Dollar Tree Walmart haul. I haven't had a haul from Dollar Tree in a very long time. I still continue to shop there, but not as much as what I used to. Let me go on ahead and get right on into my haul. I'll start with the, like, beauty items first. I picked this up. It's olive oil detangling spray by Lusty Organics. I thought this would be worth giving a try because I, when I wash my hair I do use detangling spray to get the tangles out and I normally use the Barbie kind and this just looked interesting so I want to give it a try. Oh faithful, you guys that know that watch my Dollar Tree hauls just about every time I go in there, I pick this up. It smells awesome. It smells like butterscotch candy. Picked up some baby bath. Sometimes my mom, I've started using like her routine of what she does to clean her face. She uses ivory soap, but sometimes I know she uses this too. So I picked that up and sometimes... I know my mom uses this, so I picked some of this up to use also. And this I'll probably wash my makeup brushes or my dogs with. And I didn't pick up the Angel of Mine because I like the way this smelled better. So that's why I got this, this Sesame Street brand. I picked up two packages of these, Huggies Wipes. These are great for taking off makeup, using in your bathroom, wiping off your sink, just all kind of uses. I don't have a baby, but I've been using these for years. They're great. Pick up two packages of these. One for me, one for my daughter. These are great. Now, I know every time I show these, people tell me, well, you know, you could just buy Benadryl. I know, maybe it's in my brain, but these, I guess, maybe because they're a gel cap, they just work better for me. So I picked some of these up, actually two boxes, because they work so good. I have some miscellaneous items. I had already picked my sister a pair up of these cute socks because she has a pug. But I thought my daughter might like some, too. It's, they say... Hugging adorable and they have a little pug on them They're just so cute and they say they're women's 9 to 11 And then these have a little sloth on them and they say let's hang So I picked up a pair for my daughter For myself because I thought they were cute and I think little sloths are cute and these are for my daughter I see what they say. I need space. And they have a little alien on them. So I got these for my daughter. And as I mentioned, I had already previously picked up a little pair of pug socks for my sister. I just haven't given them to her yet. Um, picked up two of these cute little gift boxes. They piece. kind of small but they'll be perfect to like put lip glosses or lipsticks in they'll be cute to give my niece and my daughter some goodies in and I saw this really pretty box I'm not gonna keep it it's gonna be used as a gift box I got the largest size they had looks to be maybe about a six by nine maybe that's the inside now, I have purchased these in the past. I actually have two that I have put lip gloss and lipstick in myself. But this is going to be for a gift. Now, I have some food items. Got two cans of these. I love this stuff. I already drank one. It's one of my favorite drinks. So good. I haven't had one since last year, so... And I wish I would have picked up more than two of these because this creamer is delicious, you guys. Cinnamon roll. I like it better than any of the other 
name brand that I've bought from Walmart. It just tastes so good. So I wish I would have picked up more than two. Honey roasted peanuts. A couple of those. Pringles Original and Barbecue. These are for my husband. But I'll probably have some too with sandwiches sometimes. So we actually picked up two of each. White cheddar popcorn. Big bag. This is really good. Movie theater popcorn. Three bags. We picked up three packages of this. And I love using these in the kitchen. I like to use my paper towels just strictly for cleaning. And I like to use these like when we eat and when I cook for napkins. I couldn't find the 200 count. This is the 160 count. And I have a very nice one of these in my kitchen that I purchased at Walmart. But I got this one to go in the area where my cat's litter box is. I lose count of how many times I sweep up after him and I was just using a small brush and a dustpan and now I'm gonna leave a regular broom and this in there because I sweep up about four times a day. Even though I have a track pad in there, you know how cats are, they just love to scratch out that litter. So that's what this is for. I'm going to leave it in the specific area where his litter box is. Now guys, that's everything from the Dollar Tree. The next few items I'm going to share with you came from Walmart. I'll share with you my like health and beauty aid items first. Black cohosh, 40 milligrams. I take two of these every morning. They help me, and I've been taking them for a couple of years straight now. Got some. I was out of this. The Acne Free Terminator 10. This stuff's great. I still get hormonal acne on my chin sometimes, and when I use this for two to three nights in a row, it helps to clear it up. I wouldn't recommend using it every day or in huge amounts because it is drying to the skin. But this stuff's awesome. Now, going along with, like, acne care, I got some of the e.l.f. Blemish Control Face Primer. It's got salicylic acid in it. 2.0. So, I don't know if I'll use it strictly as a primer or just as a treatment to see if it'll help, you know. I may try it as a primer, but really the only place I break out is on my chin and sometimes on my cheeks. But I've been wanting some of this for a while to give it a try. And got an e.l.f. brush. It's the total face brush that will be probably my powder brush. Now you guys that watch my hauls know I did get this wonderful brush. It is a... I forgot that. I think it's Moda. A Moda brush. And it's so soft. I love it. I used it for my powder. I may use it strictly for blush. I don't know. I really liked this powder brush because it was really soft. I got it on the clearance aisle at Walmart for $4.50. And I needed a new blush brush. So that's probably what this elf brush will be for. I have been needing... Some eye cream and I've had I asked you ladies to recommend a kind to me uh, several of you mentioned that elf had an under eye cream treatment which I did find and it was a good price it was $8.88 but I actually found this it was a little cheaper it's the Equate compared to Royale Revitalift anti-wrinkle and firming eye cream Reviving Anti-Wrinkle and Forming Moisturizer Eye Cream with Pro-Vitamin A Sepalift Reduces Fine Lines and Wrinkles. I believe this was under $8. There's 0 0.5 ounces in there. So, I'm going to give this a try. 
I've been needing an under eye cream for a long time. Got the smile lines going on. Got some wrinkles coming in. So, I'm going to give this a try. I'll let you guys, I'll try to remember to let you guys know if it's any good. I didn't need a body spray. But here lately I'm like into rose scented things. Like I have some rose scented shampoo that I like a lot. I saw this. It's Calgon Tuscany Rose. And it just smells so good. Fragrance Body Mist. Like before I started my video, I sprayed them on. It just smells so good. It's got a fresh, not too overpowering, just nice little rose scent to it. So, got some of this. Pick some of this up because Walmart was out. Not Walmart, but Dollar Tree was out, which is where I normally purchase this from. Self-explanatory. Needed some hairspray. This is the kind of hairspray that I love. It's the Freeze It Mega Freeze. I still use a little bit of hairspray. Like on the top when I brush out my hair and like when I use my brush rollers or my sponge rollers, like I'll spray my curls just a little bit. So, you just, a little bit goes a long way with this. So, this was like under $5. The last few things, one is cleaning. Other two are kind of miscellaneous. I needed some new floor cleaner. This is Lysol Hawaii Sunset Essence Tint. And you just get a whole lot. It has 48 ounces in here. This has a really nice scent to it. So I needed a new floor cleaner and wanted to try something other than Pine Sol. So I got this. This will last me a very long time. I use these in my tub because, ladies, you know, when you wash your hair, it clogs up the tub drain. So this will be the size probably that I put in my tub drain this is too big so this will probably be the size that i use for that and this is just kind of a little miscellaneous random item it was a halloween dress for a puppy dog so i got it for a dollar and it's just super cute little skulls and crossbones black and green tulle and the puppy dog that this will fit is fancy they didn't have any to fit my other two smaller dogs. So you guys know, I love Halloween anyway, and this is just super cute. I'll let her wear this like all the time. Not all the time, but like if I take her somewhere. Alright you guys, that's all. Thank you so much for watching this haul. I know I haven't had a haul in a long time. I know I don't do them as often as what I once did. So thank you for watching this one with me. Thank you for spending some time with me. God bless you guys. I'll talk to you all or see you in my next video. Probably it'll be... I had got this in a haul. The Real Techniques Beauty Blender. And I used it today. And I did a quick little speeded up version showing how I used it and everything. And I really like it. It's, it's good. It's under five bucks. And it's a good beauty blender. So I'll probably upload that next or first. I don't know. So be on the lookout for that. But thanks for watching you guys. Talk to you or see you in my next one. Bye everybody.